Hey everybody, Big John Hit here with Oak Creek Homes in Bryan, Texas. I want to thank you for joining me and if you want, you can't make it right now, we're going to post this video uh, for you to see it later and we'll share it out to everybody so you have an opportunity to look at this video. Now today we're going to talk about something a bit different. We're not going to be showcasing a specific floor plan or model from Oak Creek Homes. We're going to talk about the construction of our Oak Creek Homes. And uh, we feel that that's one of the important factors that sets our homes apart from our competition. Uh, you can have a beautiful home on the outside and even on the inside, but what is behind the walls? How is that home going to hold up long term? What's going to be the trade in or resale value of that home uh, years down the road? You know, those are very important factors uh, for buyers to, con to continue to consider, excuse me when looking at a home builder, uh, whether it be a site-built home or a manufactured home. So again, I wanna hope that everybody is healthy, uh, uh, safe. Uh, we're, we welcome you to our home centers here. Uh, again, I'm uh, with our home center in Bryan, Texas, and uh, uh, we're practicing uh, safe distancing. We're also wearing masks and sanitizing checking temperatures. So we're being very safe and considerate of our customers uh, and of our employees to make sure that everybody is safe. And we can also offer you a virtual tour of any of our floor plans. Uh, you can go to oakcreekbryan.com and look at those homes and almost all of them will have pictures, will have uh, uh, floor plans, will have virtual walkthroughs and pricing. So uh, if you would rather look at the homes online, or reach out to me and have me do a one-on-one -on -one virtual tour, we'd be more than happy to do that for you. Let's get started, okay? We're gonna talk about construction. What makes an Oak Creek home better? What makes an Oak Creek home heavier? What makes an Oak Creek home have a better resale value or hold its value better or increase in value? Well, we're gonna talk about that. Let's first talk about the framing of a home. Uh, it's one of the most important things that happens in a home. Uh, as you know, site-built homes are framed outside, so they start from the top and go down. They want to get that roof on first uh, to help protect the framing from the elements. And the beauty of an Oak Creek home is that our home is, is created and built inside our factory, so we don't have to worry about rain and the elements touching our framing. So we build our home from the floor up. So we start with that 12-inch I-beam frame with camber built into it to help support the home when it's set, the heavy home. And uh, we don't have to worry about water. We have the same crews. We don't have to worry about third, third party, different contractors and those issues that happen. We have the same teams doing the same jobs over and over. So I firmly believe that we actually build a better home. Let's talk about the framing. So first off, all of our Oak Creek homes, our manufactured homes are gonna have two by fours in the walls, all the walls, Interior and exterior are going to have two by four construction every 16 inches on center. We can even upgrade that if you want to a two by six on the exterior walls. Okay, so two by four construction every 16 inches on center that exceeds the manufactured HUD code that requires 24 inches. So we exceed the minimum standards by far, and that's how a site built home is framed every 16 inches on center. Now, our floor joist, and to let you know. A lot of our competition will spread those out. They'll use two by threes. They'll use and do it every 24 inches. So they're just not going to be as use as much wood product in the framing of the walls of the home. Now our floor joists are going to be two by eight floor joists every 16 inches on center. A lot of our competition is going to use two by six. So again, and they may put them 24 inches on center once again to code. So we're going to have bigger floor joists closer together. That's gonna give you more stability long-term, and again, make it a heavier home. Okay, so that's the framing of the home. Let's talk about the walls after we put all that framing on. What are we gonna put on the outside of that wall? Are we gonna put vinyl? No, we're gonna put half-inch sheetrock that will be fully taped and textured throughout the home. So all the walls, the ceilings, and 100% of the home is gonna have half-inch sheetrock Everything will be taped, floated, and textured throughout the home. That makes it heavier. If you put vinyl over gypsum, the 3 8 that's going to be a lot lighter, a lot less durable. So that's going to make our home a heavy home. 
What else do we do? Strapping. So uh, when you have those framed walls on the outside of the framing, we're gonna put extra strapping. So this is gonna go from the framing to the floor joist and we're gonna do it two times more than our competition. We're gonna have more strapping around the shear walls, around the, the entrances and exits where it has the most stress put on the home. So we're gonna put these straps and they're gonna be nailed to the framing and to the floor to help stabilize that home. Again, more of this metal and wood makes that home heavier and more valuable. We're also gonna use, you see these nails that we have, they've got a, a glue on that nail Okay, and the gun, when it's gonna shoot that nail into the wood, it's gonna heat that glue and secure that nail to the strapping and to the framing to prevent that nail from working its way out. So we use high quality nails in the building of our home. That's a huge difference because you don't want that nail that's securing those joists and strapping ever working themselves out, okay? Let's talk about the floors. Site-built homes, we all, and, and we do too, we use the same materials as a site-built home. So anybody that tells you otherwise, they're not telling you the truth, or they're thinking about manufactured homes going back 10, 15, 20 years. Look at an Oak Creek home. We're gonna use 19 30 seconds OSB flooring. It's gonna be tongue and groove. It's a heavy product. It's a very good product. Uh, almost, almost every one of your home builders, site builders, stick builders, what you want to call them, are going to use this product. We use the same thing for our flooring and for our roofing. Let's find some more stuff here. So also, you have an optional, which we recommend, and it costs very little. This is called Tech Shield. It's a radiant barrier that we can put on the walls and the roof, on the roof there, excuse me, with the OSB, you can see that. And what that's gonna do is help prevent heat from entering the home. It's gonna reflect that heat and create a barrier from that heat into your attic or to the roof of the home. So that's something that we do as well. A little bit more. The trim in the home, okay? So we've got the walls up, we've got the sheetrock up, it's taped, it's textured, it's painted. What are we gonna do about the molding and the trim? Well, most of our competition is gonna use an, an MDF. It's a wrapped plastic trim that eventually is going to come unwrapped and uh, you really can't go and replace it. Once it gets scuffed up and torn up, it's done. It's, it looks horrible. We're going to use real wood baseboards. If for some reason you ever need to replace this, you can get this product, go down to Lowe's and find this exact same real wood baseboard product. This is one of the choices that we have. And the crown molding. It's solid wood. It can be painted. It's gonna last. You can go down and replace it. If for some reason it got damaged, you can go down to Lowe's or Home Depot or your, uh, your supply there and get more crown molding that matches what you already have. Let me show you another different molding here. <clears throat> We've got our Craftsman molding, which is really popular right now. It's gonna be kind of a flat molding. So this is gonna be the baseboard. Again, solid wood. It's simple one by fours, easy to find. Okay, and here's the one by three. It's gonna go up on the top. Simple, easy to find, but again, solid wood. So it's heavier, it's gonna weigh more, it's gonna last longer, it can be painted. All right, let's talk about, now we got all the walls up, let's talk about plumbing. Okay, again, what do site builders use for their plumbing? We don't use trailer plumbing, we use what's called PEX plumbing. This is the industry standard in homes that are built today. So this plumbing, what's great about this, if in the future down the road, you ever need to replace anything in the plumbing of the home, you're gonna be able to find this product, this is your hot water line, anywhere at your local home center, your Lowe's, your office, your, uh, uh, your Lowe's, your Home Depot. You can find this stuff very easily, okay? And that's a positive, okay? Going down the road, it helps for resale value tremendously when you're trying to ever sell that property in all of our areas and i'm going to turn the camera around just for a moment because i'm going to show you a couple more things so you can see the pex plumbing there in the home and we have cutoff valves at every wet area and we even have a main shutoff valve for the entire house in the laundry area so if you have a leak in the house you're able to shut the entire water off quickly we're going to show you the flooring 
So you can see the flooring, a lot of people don't like carpet anymore. So we've gone to, a, we have a linoleum product, but I'm really excited about the planks that we have. The planks are a vinyl plank. They're extremely durable. We've got two nine by 18 planks there. You can see those, but we've added two new 12 by 24. That's a, a marble, there's a Zurich. And these are extremely thick. Look at that. Very durable, and the great thing about the plank is, is that if, it, if one gets damaged, you can replace it. So that adds a lot of resale value, and these are extremely heavy, durable. If you've got pets, got a lot of high traffic, this is gonna hold up much better. And a lot of people are getting away from carpet because it just tears up, it holds allergies. I'm gonna show you another thing that makes Oak Creek Homes worth more, efficiency. You can see our windows here. These are low E thermal pane windows. What does that mean? Well, there's, it's two layers of glass here and inside it's a sealed glass. It has an argon gas, so that acts as a, a noise barrier, a heat barrier. So I can touch that glass, even though we have the bright Texas sun shining on this window, it's cool to the touch. And it's a vinyl window, so it's not gonna hold any heat like an aluminum frame window. And this, this window can actually lift up and turn in so you can clean the inside without having to remove the screen from the outside. All right, so that makes the home extremely efficient. We have upgrade insulation. We've got R30 in the roof. We've got R13 in the walls, R22 in the floors. Much, much higher than our competition. So just to recap, what makes an Oak Creek home better than the competition, what makes Oak Creek homes more valuable and heavier? It's because we use quality products. We use real wood products throughout the home. All the tile, the backsplash, every you see in the shower is real tile. All the sinks in the restrooms are real porcelain sinks. All those things add up to a more valuable home, a heavier home, and a better home for you long term. So it's gonna last, it's gonna maintain its beauty, it's gonna be actually more affordable because it's gonna be lower repair costs going forward. All right, that's it for Big John Hit today. Uh, if you have any questions about that, wanna learn more or come see our homes, you can reach me at 979-330-4090 or you can reach me at john, J-O-N dot hit, H-I-T-T, at oakcreekhomes.com, but also go to our website. It's a great resource for you to get even more information about our, our manufactured and modular homes. That is Oak Creek, that's O-A-K-C-R-E-E-K, -E -E Brian, B-R-Y-A-N.com, and you can see these homes, what they look like, get pictures, floor plans, virtual tours, and even pricing. Thanks again, and I hope that you enjoyed and learned something from this video and we'll see you again next week. Take care.